Okay, welcome again. The next thing we're going to do is circumscribe a triangle with a circle. Circumscribe a triangle with a circle. And the last time we did is how to ascribe a circle. We're going to circumscribe a circle with we're going to circumscribe a triangle with a circle. And to do that, we're going to go through three steps. And the first one says to draw any triangle A, B, C, D, like we did with the first two. So let's do that. Okay, so I have the triangle here. Next thing we're going to do is label the triangle A, B, C. Again, always label A, B, C. And let's put C over here. Next thing we have to do, it says to um, bisect sides AC and BC to produce perpendiculars. Okay, so we're gonna bisect sides BC, and this is one side, this is one side, this is one side. Sides BC, we're going to bisect it, and you all know to bisect a line and we're going to bisect AC also, okay? And whatever those two bisection, wherever those two bisection lines meet, we're going to put O, and that's going to be the center of your circle, okay? It's very, very easy. All right, so let's do that. Okay, so to bisect a line, and it's going to be BC, you open your compass to more than half, a little more than half, this is more than half, no. You open it to a little more than half and you strike at above the line and below the line. Above and below the line. Okay? So you should have an arc here, an arc here. Okay? You take your compass, make sure it doesn't move, and you put it at B, right here. Strike another arc above, strike another arc below. Okay, this should create two points, one here, one here, and you connect the two points to make a bisection line. Okay, that's one step. The next thing we're going to do is the same thing for AC. Put your point at C, strike an arc on the left side, strike an arc on the right side. Okay. Make sure you don't get confused by the lines. And if you recall, well, you can change your compass size just so that you don't get confused. So on the left side, you strike an arc. On the right side, you strike an arc. Make sure it's more than half the distance of the line. Take your compass, make sure it doesn't move. Put it at A because it's AC we are doing. We are bisecting. Make an arc. Make an arc, okay? If you can see, this one connects, but this one does not connect. So we have to take the compass, make sure it doesn't move, put it back at C, and connect the arcs, okay? If your compass moves, then you have to start over, okay? Do not try to adjust it back to where it was. Always start over when your, your compass moves, okay? It's very important. All right, so you connect the two points right here and right here, and you draw a line. All right, so you have two points right here. Where the two lines meet, you're going to put your point, and you're going to label that O, okay? Center point of the circle. And... All you have to do now is connect your center point with any of the corners because remember it's circumscribing the triangle so it will touch either it will it should touch C A and B okay so all you have to do is put it at any one of the corners C A or B so we're going to do B and it should touch A and it should touch C okay so let's do that. Right. Come around. 
All right, so this one is a little bit off, but you get the point, okay? And that's how you subscribe, circumscribe a circle, okay? Just keep practicing. The reason why it's off a little bit is because maybe compass move or maybe I didn't take the points at a certain area, okay? So that's how you circumscribe a circle, all right? If you understood the method, just subscribe, like, and follow this channel, alright?